Hello, I am Raghu CJ and here I am gonna show you how to add a shadows to any desired shapes or any photos or any cropped uh, images. Yeah, now let's get started. Okay, here we want to first select any of the shapes like a polygon tool or you may also select a rectangle tool or a rectangle round tool ellipse tool now i'm going to select the polygon tool left click on the white screen which is a page of your screen and drag it until the di diagram or the shape shape of your size wanted now click and place where you want to place the desired shape and if you want to add the shadows to this shape click on a polygon polygon layer right click on a polygon layer and move to the blending option under the blending option select the outer glow or a drop shadows maybe i'm thinking drop shadow would uh, make it better yeah now select the drop shadow and if you i'm so i'm gonna select the outer glow um, if you select uh, nothing really ah no yeah, not yet yeah here inner shadow inner shadow is not uh, that much better i think it's do well um, you can in inner shadow you can shadow your any of your shape to the inner side of the shape For outer shadow, you want to click the outer glow and spread distance, noisy level. Yeah, here, yeah, yeah, I got it. Click on the drop shadow and decrease your noise level at zero. Now you, now you see the shadows are appear here so if you increase your opacity the darkness color of your shadow would be here and if you decrease yeah now this is a desire this is a correct uh, position uh, you can give it as uh, 35 percentage it's be better this is the distance uh, from where the shadows to be appear you can adjust it by dragging and here's the angle of the shadows would be placed now i'm gonna post it for a 90 degree yeah it downwards yeah and the size size would be the sp uh, better and uh, um, um the normal default size uh, wanted is to be a 20 much better yeah now if you sp in spread you can move like this if you see the how the shadows are spreading you must decrease this and uh, you, can, you can also increase the size uh, it would be appear like this the cut shape would be appear if you click on the spread as a higher yeah and click ok now if you move anywhere else the shadow also moves to its uh, wherever you moves and thank you for watching if you like this video please the like a thumbs up button